what? Wait, what? What is this? Oh no. Hi guys, how are you today? My name is Bailey Sarian. If you know me, which a lot of you don't, but if you did know me, you would know my ass does not sleep. Okay, I have the worst sleep schedule and insomnia, but not really, I just have anxiety. So I stay up until like three, four, five in the morning, sometimes all night, it just depends on the day. So I was up one night, I was just laying on the couch downstairs, mind my own business, and then this infomercial comes on. Ready for the miracle camouflage makeup that covers it all, serious or small. Yes, tell me more. Smart cover to my birthmark, it's so easy and so natural looking, no one knows it's there. Smart cover has really changed my life. Everyone needs this. So naturally, I had to get it. So I ordered this on the 8th, it came in on the 16th. So it was actually pretty quick. I was expecting it to be a little bit longer. On their website, I went to the section that said specials and under specials, they had different kits you could buy. I believe the one they, they were promoting on the commercial was 1995. It was like a basic kit, but then I saw this one and this one was called the Hollywood Makeup Artist Kit. <gasps> Further reading into it, I saw that their spokesperson was Christina Smith. Now, if you don't know who Christina Smith is, let me just tell you really quick. A makeup artist who works in the industry, but she's worked on iconic faces. Liza Minnelli, Elizabeth Taylor, Viola Davis, Jamie Lee Curtis, the list goes on. She's freaking worked on everybody. If she is their spokesperson, Maybe it's good. Is she still working? In this makeup artist kit, it comes with four concealing creams, moisture primer lotion, cover stick, vitamin stick, perfect touch camouflage cream, compact finishing powder, natural bronzer, tea tree oil softening stick, two-in-one glow stick, camouflage brush, all-purpose brush, and two sponges. So it comes with a lot. Now this one was pricier. It was $79.95, but like I went for it. I was like, you know what? The commercial really sucked me in. Now look at my legs. I apply smart cover, and in 10 seconds, it looks like I put on a pair of tennis. There's only like two colors, light or like medium to dark. So I picked the light one. There's a lot going on. Okay, let's see. So it comes with this pamphlet that kind of tells you everything to do. I'm so excited. Use the moisture primer lotion first. Smooths and prepares skin for smart cover concealing cream. It doesn't feel sticky. It kind of smells like, I don't know, it doesn't really have a scent to it. Okay, so then it's saying the vitamin beauty stick filled with vitamins and antioxidants to help diminish fine lines and wrinkles. I'm going around the eye. I guess it's just gonna keep it hydrated so it doesn't look cakey. That's my assumption. I have the color corrector and it doesn't tell you in this little booklet what to do with it. On the back it says maybe used as full face foundation. The color corrector? I don't know about that. What? Wait, what? What is this? Oh no. I think this you're supposed to mix in with the foundation to make it lighter. Let me look up a video really quick because what is what is this? You can use this prior to applying your concealing cream to neutralize the color and then apply the appropriate shade of concealing cream. Dab this off a bit. I thought it was like a peach. Okay, hold up. Concealing creams, it gives you a, a bunch of different colors. Light beige, medium beige, golden tan, and dark beige. They're all packaged exactly the same, which is kind of annoying. They're saying you can use a concealing cream all over as a foundation or just to like spot conceal, also to cover tattoos or like just the heavier stuff, birthmarks, eczema, stuff like that. Then they have this one, which is the camouflage cream. This one, I guess, is for spot concealing or if someone wants more of like a natural look, I guess, but they were also saying you can use this as a foundation. This, which is, Smart Cover Stick in Natural Beige. I guess this is the one that goes under the eyes. So I'm gonna go on with the concealing cream like on this side, because this is where I have the hyperpigmentation. So let's just try it out. I'm gonna use light beige, and the girl on the tutorial was using her finger. So I wanna make sure that I'm doing it like her. Ooh. She was also saying to use a buffing motion with your finger. I mean, it definitely dries down very matte. I didn't put it under here because I wanna see how this concealing stick in natural beige does. That worked nice. It does look really cakey though, like really dry, even though I use that vitamin stick, okay? Let me try this. This is the camouflage cream in natural light. Now they were saying to use your finger cause you gotta warm it up to make it nice and creamy. Let me see how this covers. It's not really covering my hyperpigmentation. I use the makeup every day. I won't leave home without my makeup on. I've been layering it and it's starting to cover now. <laughs> when it dries, it doesn't move. So it's really hard to like blend the edges because I didn't blend them right away. I should have known. Just take some layering, but we're getting there. I'm using the little sponge that it came with. It's just like a normal cosmetic sponge. There's really not much to the sponge. 
this is what we're gonna do right now. We're all just gonna start barking, have a bark party. So it did cover after a couple layers. It looks cakey, especially right in here. It dries very matte, it's kind of sticky. Before, after. I wonder if the owner is still alive. I mean, in those infomercials I saw, she looked very mature. She was very aggressive and oh, she was real rough. And she also has wrinkles. She has deep furrows. <laughs> she has a little redness on her nose. Immediately, and you're right, Flory. It's not just dark circles. The I mean, after a couple layers, I mean, it did cover it. Do you see the cakey? Shut the up. That's not my dog, that's a neighbor's dog. So I could say that. So they're saying this is a cream blush and a lipstick. So let me say, that's nice and natural. It's nothing special. I'm gonna set with the compact finishing powder and this has color to it. I thought it was gonna be translucent. It's not deep. I use this to like set my under eye cause it's creasing. Oh, it's very yellow. Oops, okay. I felt like it wasn't awful until I used the setting powder. Now we're just stuck. Believable bronzer. This brush is very rough. Oh shoot. It's like a nice bronzer that adds some warmth. I mean, I'm not against this. I might use this. What do you guys think? Definitely not what I always do. Okay, we know that. But it's not awful, but it's not great. It's not life-changing like the commercial made me feel like it was gonna be. I'm very gullible, I guess. My under eye just looks a mess, but I layered so much under my eyes, so I really don't expect it to look any better. The bronzer, I kind of like the bronzer. I think I'm gonna use it in the future, to be honest with you, it's a nice bronzer. Now it claims to cover tattoos. I might as well just like throw it on over my hand and see what happens. Should I use the color corrector first? Cause they say you should use the color corrector, but um, it's very thick. So, I mean, if you're gonna use this to cover your tattoos, it's gonna look like makeup. I did a tattoo coverage video like a couple weeks back. If you are curious to know how I like to cover tattoos, okay? Wow, so much coverage just happening. So this is about five layers. You can still see my darkness peering through. It looks like makeup. Obviously it's not my color. I couldn't imagine using this all over your legs like in the commercial. I think she was lying. Anyways, so overall for $79.95, you get a lot of stuff. It's not awful. I mean, it does cover. I think I might use these products again, to be completely honest with you. I don't know you guys, I'm conflicted. Let me know what you think down below if you've ever tried this product. And if you see any products that you've seen on TV, let me know because I love as seen on TV products. I am a sucker for them. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a great day today. You make great choices. And um, I'll be seeing you guys very soon. Bye.